Hey guys, just a little quick recap here. My box I broke today. Uh, periodic throughout the day. Uh, a little bit when I first got it, a little bit at home. Uh, 1718 Series 1 Upper Deck Series uh, Retail Box. It's 35 bucks, 24 packs. You know, cheap. Little break. Not a good crop, but... You know, I mean, for 35 bucks, it's a good deal. Like a buck fifty a pack. There's the odds. One of the main draws is the Day with a Cup fill in here. It might be in... I think it's in Series 1. I don't know if it's... It might be in Series 2 and I think about it, but... You know, it's him eating hot dogs in the golf course. You know, classic card. There's some decent guys in here, like, uh... Brock Besser and Nico Heischer. Uh, Charlie McAvoy in here, so... Some solid young guns. Here's what I got. I have some of these priced out already for, like, card show and stuff. These are all just, like, you know, the base. I, the box I have is in over there. Somewhere else in my room with uh, the base and the stars and stuff. But here are the, just the inserts and stuff I got. So these are the portraits. So you got Artem Anisinov. There's the front. There's the back. I actually don't mind this here, this portrait design. Zach Wierenski, Sebastian Ajo, and Tyler Sagan. Here are the shooting stars. These are the, they do it by position. So here's the center, the most common one. I actually like the shooting stars here. The foil, I like it. The nice looking cards. Here the left one is just slightly more rare. You got Pacioretty and Brad Marchand. So that's not bad. Some canvases. Ryan Hartman. There's the front, there's the back. I do like the canvases. I like this here, honestly. So, uh, Jake Gardner. And Elias Lindholm. And then here we go. We got a Shining Stars Red. These are fairly rare, especially with a left winger. These are like one in actually, one in over 100 packs. The left wingers are more rare than the centers, and the goalies are more rare than the left wingers. But yeah, the Taylor Hall. It was nice with the Devil's jersey, although now he's in the Sabres. And here's some young guns. We didn't do great. We didn't do terrible. Um, can't. They, we got all guys who still are NHLers. You know, albeit you know Cam a fringe NHL, but still. Let us left Cam Nev. He's still young. Like it's under, it's like 24 or something. A young gun. Uh, Christian Fisher. He's had some really good. He had a really good season a couple years ago. Still a younger player, still a nice, like, solid two-way power forward kind of player. Still still young, like 23, so he's a decent little player. Uh, Tate Thompson still has a lot of potential, big part of the Ryan O'Reilly trade. Big prospect, he's only 23 as well. He's younger, so he's had an okay, he has some offensive potential. Bjork played some first-line minutes this year. Uh, definitely a good bottom six guy, younger, still younger, now still only 24. Solid little player. Uh, Travis Sanheim, he's an absolute beast, this guy in blue line. Really good. I remember watching the playoffs against the Islanders. He was really good. And he's still, you know, 24 as well. A young, good blue liner. Good, great top four guy. Great, good defensively. Good for around 30, 35, po 30, 35 points a year. And then Tyson Jost definitely has a lot of offensive potential. A lot of upside. I think he's a what, third liner. Maybe second liner in uh, Colorado. Off the top of my head, I think, I think he's third liner. Because they have Kadri. Uh, you know, he's definitely a third liner. But still. He's had a lot of potential. They might move him, I've heard, because of a contract situation, but he's still only 22. He's a great young player. So I'm pretty happy with that. The young guns, I'm honestly pretty happy with. We didn't get anyone great, but I'd say, like, these five are all at least solid. You know, especially these these two, are, I think, are very, very solid. And then we did get a jersey card. We got a very nice one. Definitely better now than it was then. He's still a good player then, but now he's a superstar. Leon Dreisel, Dreisel UD game jersey. So that's just a quick little recap, guys. I'm pretty happy with the box. I made my money back, no, but was it a fun little rip? Yeah. And I do love these young gun designs. But yeah, that's what we guys. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I am out.